Ooh. Hey guys. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so, I guess we all know the news. E Sung Min from Super Junior is getting married. And I'm happy for him. Watch the other video. It's called E Sung Min. No, it's called Congratulations, Sung Min and Sotin. But, um, I have something to say. And it's not so much our international fans, it's more so I'm not aggravated, but I'm a little bit, I'm upset. You want to know why? Because I feel like, I, you, you guys know, like I stated in another video, I'm an elf, but I'm disappointed in Korean elves. You know why? Because and and I just I don't it's like I got so much to say. I don't even know how long this video is, but it is it doesn't matter at this point. I'm disappointed in elves more so because I feel like not internationals, the Korean elves. Because for y'all to be on Twitter and hashtag Sung Mean Out, I feel like that's just plain disrespectful and for us to be called everlasting friends, you would think that a super junior getting married, like at the age that they are, you would be fucking supportive. Like, you know, like that, that blows me. This is why I get frustrated with these Korean fans. And I try not to, like, I, I don't want to offend nobody really, but I just like, I'm trying to speak the, I'm speaking the truth. I'm keeping it real. Some of them Korean fans, not all, y'all do not know y'all place. You feel, but it's not only just them. I feel like K-pop companies, you need to stop selling these images to these young girls that Opa is going to sit around here forever and marry you when it's not the case. You need to, like, they need to start doing something different instead of feeding these white lies to these children just to, I mean, I'm not saying that they do it to reel them in, but. I mean, you, I mean, I fan service is another way to keep the girls in, but that's not to me. It's not as bad as it is like telling fan girls that you know, oh, I'm gonna be single forever and I'll wait for you. And it's like, no, don't tell them that. That's how they get delusional, and and it's just like I'm I'm irritated with that. Like it's annoying. Like Sung Min is about to be thirty, or is already thirty. So what do you expect? He's not going to be, <sighs> you think he's going to be with, I mean, Super Junior is always going to be where they are right now, but you guys have to understand that they eventually are going to live their lives. Like, I can't even deal. Like, this shit is annoying. Like, I'm trying not to cuss, but I get so frustrated because it makes me look at certain, like, I'm embarrassed as an international elf because I feel like when it comes to us, the international elves, we don't care and we support it. We're supporting him. The rest of them are just like, oh, screw Sung Min. He lied to us and date in secret. I'm like, excuse me, who are y'all to tell anybody what they should be doing with their life? That's what I get frustrated with K-pop. Stop telling these idols what they should and what they should and what they shouldn't do with their lives. If they want to get married, okay, that's fine. They're supposed to do that. Like, oh my gosh, like, aren't half of Korean elves, like, damn near, like, over the age of 19 already? Like, aren't y'all getting married too? So what's the problem? What's the issue? I am i don't understand that. Like, some people are just mental. Like, they're delusional. Some of y'all Korean fans are just delusional, and I'm, and I'm sick and tired of it. Get out of, re like, stop living in a fucking... I'm sorry, I'm not trying to cuss too much, but it's like stop living in a hole and come to reality that nobody that is an idol is going to marry you. Like I stated, I can love Suju all day, but I know damn well in my not deluded mind that none of them are marrying me. Even if it was like going to happen, it's like a one in a million chance. Y'all taking stuff a little too serious. Like just love the music and support them. You, bit okay. Here's how I see it. 
your music and your personal life are two totally different things. I separate that. I listen to their music of any K-pop, not just Super Junior, but I do not care about their personal business because that has nothing to do with me. I'm not screwing them myself. I'm not buying them food. I'm not providing them clothes and shelter. And I'm not their manager. I'm not signing a check for them. So I, I just get irritated with that. And then some of y'all feel like El Korean else, not all. Because I know some people are going to get mad. Okay, whatever. Dislike the video because I'm just telling the truth. Some of y'all feel like you have an entitlement, which you do not have. Just because you're buying their music. And you go to every freaking concert does not mean you have a right to tell them what they should be doing in their personal life. And that's what we're not going to do. I'm not trying to come off too ghetto, but it's like, it's just, yeah, yeah, my viewers, you know, if you watch the video, anybody that's not a viewer, it's called keeping it real. And let, like, let's be real here. Stop with the delusion. Half of y'all are not even teenagers anymore. So you still are acting like a teenage child with your pop. They're probably, some of them are probably like adults with teenage mentalities. It's like. You don't own them. Nobody owns anybody. You do not have the right to say the things that y'all saying. So that's why I'm, I stand by Sung Min. I've always stood by him. And I stand by any Super Junior member. And another thing that somebody pointed out. Why I just cut myself off mid-sentence. I don't get. The hypocrisy, hypocrisy is real. Because when she don't wants to date someone and get married. Don't nobody say shit. But Sung Ming, it's like, oh, we finna be all up in our feelings. Oh, like, you did betray us and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, y'all be having favoritism. Like, I don't understand. Like, okay, maybe, okay, okay, because Shi Dong is, or, or maybe not the most attractive, or maybe he was, like, the most fat one. It's like, it's not an issue for y'all. But Sung Ming, it's like, we want to get in our feelings. What? I don't understand that. Like, bitch, what? I'm confused. Can somebody explain that to me? I'm confused. We want to pick and choose what, what we want to get mad at. Okay, whatever. You know what? I'm done. That's pretty much all I got to say. My whole opinion, I'm excited for him. I can't wait to see the wedding photos. Y'all do it big. And congratulations. And for all y'all, KLs, you are being selfish as hell right now. Because for y'all to be fans and you say that you're always going to be there for Opa, you, are sure, you sure aren't doing it right now. Like, kick rocks. Get your own damn life. Stop being thirsty for idol dick that you ain't gonna get. Peace. Have a nice day. Like and comment. <sighs> Got me all mad. <laughs> but, hey, yeah, that's what happens when you speak the truth. If y'all wanna dislike the video because, you, you know, I didn't hurt y'all feelings, okay, I don't care. <sighs> Bye. <laughs> Craziness.